Hey guys, Mr. Fasciabo here. I'm going to show you a cool thing that I found on my iPhone. That I can do. I found out that I was able to change the firmware of my device without using iTunes while upgrading or downgrading. I can show you through City how I did it. As you can see, I'm in iOS 4.3.2, but I made it turn to 4.3.1. Alright, you can see that. I was 4.3.1. I'm going to show you how I did it. First of all, you're going to need Cydia and you're going to need iFile, and that's all you need. Open up iFile. You're going to need to go to slash system library. Core services, and then you have to go all the way down to system version dot p list. I'm gonna have how to get there in the description below. Once you get there, open the p list and click property list viewer. Then it's gonna tell you the the version of your device and the product number which is the parentheses next to the version you don't need to touch the product name or the product copyright all you need to touch is the product build version and the product version see I'm gonna go back to iOS 4.3.2 so the product version for iOS 4.3.2 is 8H7 and then the version is 4.3.2 and that's it now go click done and then after you add that you'll see uh, another system version the plist percent under it just delete that then reboot your device Let your device reboot. Then we'll change my boot logo using boot logo, air join boot logo. And once it turns on, it'll say I was 4.3.2. Please rate, comment, subscribe.